It's such a pleasure to be working with the Sherwood Chamber here in Pulaski County, Arkansas, in the 2nd Congressional District, and talking to business owners and how they're negatively impacted by the incredible inflation that we've been feeling since last summer of 2021. It's only gotten worse. We have producer prices at 11 percent. Uh, over the past year and we've had inflation that we feel in our own families supposedly at eight and a half percent but we know in many places it's a lot higher gas is up 44 percent housing and rent are more expensive than that eight percent and certainly if you go to the grocery store it isn't an eight percent increase it's a lot higher we've done gas cards for a lot of our employees because that's been the hardest thing for our employees is getting to work, getting to their families to take care of. The same, you know, 13%, 10% increases, but last week my manufacturer gave me a 52% increase. Wow. In one, and that's not counting, you know, the increases that were up to that. The salon in general, we've had prices of gloves go up, foils, um, the price of foils has way increased. Um, and so we're just seeing a lot of the products that we use on a daily basis, they're increasing. So that's made a big impact on us. What I'm trying to do as a member of Congress is fight that inflation. How do we take steps that unleash American energy to get gas prices lower? How do we untangle the supply chain to get prices lower in the grocery store? And how do we have the Federal Reserve take the steps that they need to stop printing money? And so these are steps we're taking to fight inflation.